we're getting more videos out. I'm happy about it. Um, it's uh, this one's a movement uh, ambush list. Um, really fun list. This list is super hard to bleed sometimes, man. Or if you're trying to bleed it, you uh, you're probably going to lose your card. But it's like you have to because you have to either get the scenario out of them or the um, the gezers. Which I mean, the card is just really really good it's it, i like it too because it's a nice answer for lippy it punishes lippy sometimes um since it fills that row up so quick if they greet it out or whatever um but yeah it's i just i really enjoy this list um it seems like officers are always the mulligan fodder um everything else i mean has got a purpose you do have a sapper in here to uh possibly purify uh rupture from uh Turg V, Purified Defenders and stuff, if the Elf's already on the board. Just a random uh, rebuke. Uh, Siaran for the Keldar, you know, interaction if you need to. And uh, this one has Gaten in it. The one on the website, I believe, is a little bit different. I like this version a little bit better. Because um, Gaten gives you some nice push sometimes. Where you could stack on that front melee row and then... Um, you know, just get a big, a big bump from some of the other cards, um, especially too if you got the century down on that back row. Each one gets an extra, extra point. Um, so it's got a chance to, you know, swarm with Isengrim or just you know, get a ton of value with the scenario. I just I think the list is really really versatile. It's not all you know. I, I don't know. It, it just it matters on positioning. There's just so many things about the list that I really, really enjoy. And uh, just having this little Sentry mat Matron um, Witcher package is just so nice. Bronzes that can put in so much work. Um, but, uh, yeah. Um, you can go to another one with uh, Magic Lamp uh, Crystal Skull uh, to possibly protect your uh, Cat Witcher or Sentry. Um, but other than that, man, it, it, like I said, this ver there's this version and uh, the one that's on the website. I prefer this one actually better. I think it performed a little bit better for me and Wasubi as well. But uh, quick video today, guys. I just I'm just happy I can get out more videos. It was it was rough the last couple of weeks. I had a lot of stuff going on, and uh, you know, it was just mostly um, being able to sit down and do the latter video, maybe like a one off and stuff. Uh, here and there but i was able to get some stuff recorded so um lots of good stuff coming on the way man i hope you guys enjoy it um i'll see you guys at the end so we just ditched it yeah i was like yeah okay oh, hello there pirate he's okay. a tactical advantage friend i see i see we got movement uh, for a boat yeah dragoon is good could just mold the uh, uh, the officer. No, Bowman's decent officer, I think. And then uh, it's a lot of goals, though. No movement engines, really. Uh, I guess yeah, Bowman is a good mulligan. Oof. Well, so we draw two sentries, and we didn't find any of the other move engines, which is kind of sad, but. I guess we can just go for Cadvitcher with the Oniromancy, right? Should be good. So he actually. plays one boat, TAs it. Oh, yeah. Doesn't uh, take. We don't have our curse. Wait, a blacksmith. What? Okay. What? <laughs> what in the. So we just drop the century? Oh, yeah. Sounds good. I don't know though if the if the movement package is like good enough here without any further support. Oh, well, it's that... this. Well, that's a rebuke, I think. No, oh, we okay. can't get it. Right. Well, we could always just curse it later, but that means we cannot play the the Oniro for the freaking Cat Witcher, right? Yeah. Which is annoying. But I mean, like, if the Cat Witcher dies, then this sentry is useless anyway, so that's what I mean. Like, 
Also, what the hell is Mr. playing? Like, I'm really curious. So what do we go with? See, I think he's gonna play another one. Kinda weird, right? Mm -hmm. Do we just play Kinda the other weird. one, or do we save it? Yeah, I could just play it, honestly. Yeah. Kaya! Then play the Cat Witcher, and maybe it actually sticks at a 6. Looks like, honestly, it just looks like we're gonna play, um... We're gonna play Vernalsiel, and then, like, Gezra, maybe? Do we move uh, it, or we don't even care? Yeah, 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 we just move it, exactly, yeah. Yep, I don't see why not. Uh, it was probably better to go for the Cat Witcher right now, but... I think... By delaying... You're already, like, denying some points here and there. We just rebuke that, right? Yeah, just rebuke it. Definitely. Uh, hmm. Like you said, we are delaying our engines. Yeah, but also... Seagull. Oh okay. Very interesting. I mean... Could just pass at this point. If you want to play on, it's a bit... Like, he's at 35 points, right? Yeah, well, he has a two-point engine. Yeah. He, I mean, he committed, like, a lot. He played his defender, he played, like, three or four engines. We just played, like, dead sentries and called it a day, basically, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's what happened. Kind of funny. I think we banished the defender. Mm, we could, yeah. Okay. Guess Ellerin goes, and then the officer. Yeah. All right. There he is, the lad. Well, kind of needed you last round, buddy. Hmm. Osiris. Oh God. Okay. Well, I guess we just cat witch her then. Yeah, that's a pretty sweet Gezra as well later on. Yeah, I work for the But yeah, I'm not sure if we can actually defend without the scenario. Uh, I guess it depends how aggressive he gets. But yeah, Harold. Harold. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty fun. That, 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 that's an interesting deck for sure, right? Like... Mm, guess at this point you go with the Feign Death, because he's clearly very committed. I mean, he, he could also pass on it, but then we're still fine, right? Doesn't really matter. And also... I guess it's less likely to... Yeah, this is fine. Disable... Uh, like, the, the commando is disabled, right? But... It's fine. Alright. What do you hit? Sure. That's fine. Ah, heatwave! Oniro heatwave! Yeah, yeah, yeah! <laughs> so good! Uh, I don't know what this deck is supposed to be doing, but... Why don't we get that? Yeah. So we have to Vernosiel now. Mm-hmm. we we'll just go Vernosiel, yeah. It's so annoying, though, that, like, this is this is the round where he stops playing, like, tall units, right? Right. Actually wondering if... Ah, uh... oh, no, yeah, leader charge is never a consideration, right? Yeah, it's not. Okay. Yeah, because this jumps back, hits that, and it's... Yeah. You need yeah, two. Yeah. Uh, what a game, what a deck. It's, uh... Oh, there we go, there's the tall unit. Mm -hmm. There we go. Alright. Could just, uh, squirrel the Nero, honestly. Take it slow. Go back row, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just setting up the Gezra, basically. 
Now he's like, no, cheat. <laughs> <laughs> Big cheat. Double ah, priest. The double priest. I guess we curse now. And then we can go Gezra. Uh, hit his entire front row. And that should defend the bleed, I would think, right? I mean... Now I do we leader? Hope. No, no, we don't, because he still has good points here. Well, I mean, we could have, but we also don't mind just taking it with the Bowman, right? That's the point. And if he goes a card further, he just loses a card. Yeah, okay, well, whatever. So he goes. He has Canute. I would imagine something like that. Yeah. Do we just go Heatwave on that? Yeah, we don't want to Gezers think... now. Well, but then he gets to canoe it on the Olaf. I think you heat wave it. I think it's better. Okay, so basically you're getting plus two. You get plus two, he gets plus one. Yeah, could use a leader charge now, honestly. Yeah. Problem is if we play one more elf, the Elrin comes out, but whatever. I mean, our plan is to play the Gezra anyways. Oh what? god, okay. What a, what a smart back. Interesting. Mm. So I guess we prefer hitting his row first? I guess, yeah. It's fine. <clears throat> so his yeah, last cards. I I'm not sure, I, I, but I think you just go Gezra here for Rondo, actually. Here, right? Yeah, yeah. Do I use a leader charge? Nope. No point in showing mercy. No point at all. Nice. Yeah. I mean, he gets the vote, Carl, but... Wait. So, wait. Uh, no, 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 the Gezra hits the vote, Carl, right? And he transforms to the 12. So, he's basically getting uh, 9 points. But then he loses 4 points. So he's getting five points, so it's fine. <laughs> so we passed. Not sure what he was thinking there. On yeah, yeah, yeah. Not sure what he was thinking there, honestly. Like, it just takes a bit to count, right? But like, gets nine, loses four. That's a five. And yeah, we're <laughs> like, this is perfect, right? Like the Elrin is still in the deck. I was so worried we actually end up. Well, the question is, can we even get her out? Anyway. I mean, I don't think you can mulligan elves, if I'm being honest. Like, what else is in the deck? I don't know. Uh, Yaven. There's Yaven. Oh, there's a Soul Swordmasters. Uh, is this matron good? I guess we could just mull her. Alright, maybe we keep this. I don't know. Uh, so we have exactly... Five elves with the leader charges, provided none of the elves actually die. It's a bit weird. Is anything right? row locked? Um, starting front is good. Yeah, yeah, because he can have like long ships style. or That's the right. red ships. Like sorry, not sure if he actually played any. No. But don't think he did, right? Yeah. Oh. oh. Well, that's annoying. Could just go for a uh, sword must. Like, <laughs> don't we don't we want Yaven <laughs> for the? Monster. Don't we want Yaven? Well, sure. Yeah, I could also just go Yaven. Doesn't really matter. So we just Bowman. No, I, I was I was thinking like just Oniromancy into the sword master, but I don't know about that. Could have like Lugos. Hmm. 
Yavin is probably fine. J yeah, just go proactive Yavin, whatever. Uh, stacking back row, right? For the Bowmans. Sorry, not the Yavin. Ah, God. Ice and Grim, right? What am I talking about? Yeah, just use two and... Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Uh, yikes. I was like, <laughs> I'm like, if you want to play Yavin, we can. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, just, I just keep mistaking the two for some reason. Hunter. So that's a back ah. row. That's good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's really good. Do we just kill it with Yavin? Yeah, exactly. That's so good, right? Like, and watch. Now we get scorched. I can already see it. And, uh, and Olaf deck with scorch. Let's go. Oh. I mean, I think our elves are surviving, honestly. Unless he gets, unless he gets very lucky with. Okay, yeah. It was a weird game. <laughs> really weird game. Well, he has renew for something, right? Ah, the, the renew paranoia continues. <laughs> <laughs> it does, dude. I mean, why would you bleed that hard? I have no idea. I mean, yeah, it's just like a wholesome. Holy shit! <laughs> oh wholesome. boy. Point slam deck of some some sort, but yeah. Uh, our our engine package in round one was like so dysfunctional. The, the, this is this happens sometimes with the deck, unfortunately. But yeah, yeah pulled through. Masubi, thanks for recording, sir. We got some uh, some movement elves yeah. coming. Uh, really just, fun deck. Uh, like, yeah, and another take on the elves, like. Uh, we did the medic one earlier. This is the one with the movement engines. So, yeah, just an alternative. Yeah. So, like always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, make sure you check out TLG.GG for the meta snapshot and other good stuff coming. And yeah, uh, there's a TV coming, right? TV's coming. Max oh, yeah. Max jumps on there every once in a while. He's been yeah, playing he some will, random he will be stuff. Doing some variety for sure. Yeah, so check that out. Yeah. We, we like Max. Coaching, all the good stuff on Twitch and YouTube. Yeah. You just plan to interact more with the community because that's always good fun. So absolutely, absolutely. Stay but, tuned, guys. Yeah, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.